Welcome in our next guest to the Blue Couches, Edward O'Brien. He's the CEO of the YMCA of Cory, and you guys have a, a really exciting uh, couple of days coming up. Cory Fest, and this is the first year the Y is partnering with yes. the Chamber. Yep, nope, that's correct. Uh, so June 15th through June 18th, uh, Cory Block Party uh, is going to feature Bear Hollow Carvers. Uh, they're based out of French Lake, Indiana, okay. and uh, it is nationwide, world-renowned chainsaw carving artists. Wow, and they're yeah. all going to be carving at the same time in the park, mm -hmm. four days. Yes. Right, and so <laughs> yeah. you can come and watch that. Are there other things in the park at the same time as yeah. well? Yeah, so we're going to have uh, vendors downtown. There's going to be a kid zone. Uh, we do have a beer garden, so if someone wants to have an adult beverage and watch uh, the chainsaw carvers mm -hmm. carve. Uh, that Hopefully is the chainsaws aren't having adult beverages <laughs> yeah. while they're chainsawing. <laughs> yeah, <definitely. laughs> well, at least not while operating. That's hopefully. right, yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, but also we're gonna have concerts every night as wow. well. And you've got big names for that. Yeah, we do have a lot of mm -hmm. local artists. Uh, so Dan Bainey and Tyler McLean will be playing on Thursday night. Our state representative, uh, Jake Banta mm -hmm. with Jake's Blues, will be playing Friday night. Mm -hmm. And then Chris Higby uh, oh, wow. will be Saturday night. Yeah, that's why, terrific. Why do something like this uh, for the Cory community? Well, it's, that's a great question. We wanted to try to do something that was different and unique mm -hmm. that brought outside folks from the county down to Cory uh, and see our town, all the local renovations that we've been doing. And there's been a real resurgence in Cory uh, that the town has really come a long way. Mm -hmm. So we wanted to do our part and kind of have a, uh, kind of create a beacon for people to come check us out. Sure. Is this the first year for this particular event? Uh, so typically Cory Fest always happened. Um, we This is the first year that uh, the YMCA is partnering with Corey, okay. yeah, with the chamber. So talk a little bit about these chainsaw artists. I mean, it is really incredible uh, to, to watch them do. work or, and to see the end result, but I can't imagine watching them do it. It must be really, really interesting. It is very interesting. Uh, watching a, you know, a log get transformed into a three-dimensional, mm -hmm. very unique, very custom product is really remarkable. And how they can use such a bulky tool oh, yeah. to create their art yeah. is really amazing. Well, it's really cool because they use a variety of different sizes of chainsaws oh. to really get the detail work. Mm -hmm. And then they also use other types of uh, power tools to okay. to really get the, the realism. And when folks come down uh, to this event, are they able to kind of interact with these artists, ask questions? And yeah, no, there'll definitely be time where the artists will be taking breaks because obviously that's a very long day yeah. for yeah. using power tools <laughs> that they can ask, answer questions and they'll be available. And then all of these things that are produced during this festival will then go up on the auction box, Correct. right? Cool. Yes, yep, and that is going to be uh, Saturday night. Uh, and also Sunday. Okay. So those two auctions, the proceeds will benefit the YMCA Corey. Is that an online auction or do you have to be there present? You do have to be there present okay. for these okay. two auctions. And a lot of this happening, I don't know if we mentioned City Park, right? Talk yep. a little bit about yep. that. Downtown uh, City Park. Um, in years past, Corey Fest was uh, spread out throughout the town. Uh, we're localizing it. So Friday night there'll be a car show, uh, which was mm -hmm. typically up in, a pl in the plaza. So um, there'll be a lot to do in a Mm -hmm. small it's area. nice to have everything yeah. in one spot, really, yeah, kind of a big old block party. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Exactly. Um, and how do folks find more information? Um, you can visit us on our Facebook page, uh, which is uh, Corey Block Party uh, Chainsaw Carving Music Festival. Great. Um, and then also, if you if there is anybody, we're still accepting vendors, you can okay. reach out Cherie Dickey at the Cory Area Chamber of Commerce. Great. Okay. Are these concerts, are they free? Yes. Wow. How about that? That yeah. is a, the, you're right. Those are some really big yeah. names. Some what talented are you most artists. looking forward to? I, you know, this is the first time we put on an event such like this. And I'm just really interested to see it all take place. You just want it to go well. <laughs> yeah, I want, it, I want it to go well, but it, it, it's also very unique. Yeah, it something is. something different. Sure. And so, you know, anytime we can work together with the community to bring on something like this yeah. is uh, is really remarkable. And really you're inviting Corey and beyond yeah. Yeah. Uh, so to, to go on down uh, in the, the next couple of days, right. next couple of weeks. Ed, thanks for joining thanks us no, today. Thank you. Yeah. All right, we'll be right back.